Pokes the win. We're gonna play the um, tour 1v1 versus Ruby Newt. I think it sounds like a good player. Maybe it's really bad or really good. One of the two. Playing Marco Simeone Golf and Country Club. That was the course that hosts the Ryder Cup. I'm book, book, book. All right, hope you're having a terrific, wacky Wednesday. I am kind of, I don't know, I'm just in a interesting situation. All right, Ruby Newt on the tee. Barbecue chicken alert right down the pipe. Oh shit. There's this form, I think. And I remember this could be the the lady I seen that was there is like some group where they play this game all the time. And uh, I think I'm playing the lady that was like running it kind of so that's going to be interesting so this is going to be a tough match for sure probably anyways I thought I would uh, I tried recording a video yesterday and the uh, audio was kind of fucked so you might not be hearing this one either because I did try to fix it though I tried to fix the audio and uh, we hit to 7 Eleven. Today's sponsor, 7 Eleven. Just kidding. Please don't sue me. Alright, Ruby Newt for Birdie. Gonna go with the putter. Can't blame her. As for a schedule this week, I don't know. Um, I'm 20 days away from going to LA, to Tokyo, and uh, almost made it, Ruby Newt did. And I have to make uh, some bank. And there's no number that's high enough. It can always go higher. But there is a number that is low enough where it's like, oh fuck, and I gotta get past that number. Anyways, we're one up through one against Ruby here on this Wacky Wednesday, so streaming or recording videos. I tried doing one yesterday, like it just, uh, the audio was fucked. So, I don't know. We're gonna, we'll fix it, we'll figure it out eventually. Everything's kind of like panic mode right now. Um, I'm like 11, 11 days away from, I think I sell my VR headset, someone wanted it. And then I gotta sell like my PS5, my Nintendo Switch. And then I gotta figure, I have no idea where I'm staying in Tokyo. I have no idea where I'm going from Tokyo, how long I'm staying there, and uh, so I gotta figure it out, but at the same time, it's tough to figure out, and uh, so yeah, that's kind of the update, I'll give, I'll give a little more as we go, but focus on golf here a little bit, Ruby, second shot here, not bad. We are playing in heavy winds, so if you're not a heavy wind player, this is going to be a, a very tough round. Um, but I am a heavy wind player, so this one's going to be close to maybe a little too short, but it wasn't, so neat. That's neat. I think we got the full 97%. Could have been 93 and we would have been, you know, maybe not even on the green. Ruby just buries it right in the back of the throat. 
Just bangs that cup hard. All right. It's a birdie for book, book, book. We're still one up. I know for, I'm, I'm like very, very, very certain. I can't uh, let up in this match at all or I'll get fucking beat. And the thing is, I'm not in the mood to lose. You ever been in that mood? Not in the mood to lose. So right now, it's 9.40 a.m. on a wacky Wednesday. In an hour, I'm going to go and get my uh, COVID booster. My fourth uh, COVID shot. Get juiced up for, uh, I don't know, just... I do deliveries to so protect against uh, me getting in and transmitting to others, plus traveling. It's no-brainer, really. And... Uh, so then, usually that gives you a sore arm, so I gotta get my golf in before my arm's too sore to flick the stick. Stickflicker.com, coming soon. Here's Ruby Newt's second shot, looks like it, it looked really good to be fair. Still 11 footer up the hill. Now I did overswing there because I think if I hit the number I might have spun off the green. I noticed at the last second it was 97, 93 instead of like 100. And uh, so it was on me. I gotta make this putt though. It seems like I'm gonna make this putt but I don't know it's kind of early in the morning. Yeah didn't make it. When I looked at it, it's like, you know what, that's... See, now we're going to be fucking all square. This is straight up the hill. That's why you don't... hit shit shots. Wow. It was straight in. And she played a left edge. Outside left cup. It was straight putt. And we're still one up. See, I don't discriminate just because you're a female. I'll still give you shit for missing a straight in butt. Okay, that's a little strong on the swing, but shouldn't be too bad. It's pretty bad, but not like real life bad where it's like actually bad I don't play uh, this game as much anymore obviously since I gave up on the tournament grind um, but so not super sharp I could play like a couple matches and get sharp again but I just wanted to uh, put a video out. I, I had done the Ryder Cup challenges yesterday where there's like 12 challenges and uh, some of them I really struggled and others I did fucking amazing. There's some insane highlights and I was hoping to upload that video but it was, I recorded it and it was 49 minutes so I was gonna, it was gonna take a long time to cut it down to about 15 but then once I heard the audio that was it was just shit. I was like, ah, fuck. Just delete it, I guess. Like, there is a challenge where it said, like, chip in from the bunker. And I chipped in from the bunker twice in a row. And you just can't experience that magic. Man, I suck.
I'm under reading. That's two under reads. Am I just trying to play with Ruby Newt for longer? Probably not. I'm just shit. I'm really bad. I'm one up, but to be fair, it should be three up. I mean, I would say two up because Ruby should have made that putt. <laughs> Still harping on some random person missing a putt. Oh, today is also, besides uh, get booster day, at taco time. I don't know if this is all taco times. I know it's not Taco Bell. It's Taco Time. But there's a Taco Time like two blocks away from me. So 99 cent tacos. Limit of three. So I'm going to get three tacos. And then for the first time in my life, I'm going to try churros. So it's going to be an exciting adventure after my, uh, my poke in the arm. But how I see things is I have 19 or 20 days, including today. And I got to do like $100 on average in deliveries. And I can't like take a day off. And like yesterday I took a day off and went and watched Saw X. And uh, can't do that. I got to. You know, fucking go hard. That was, that was so bad. So bad. My voice cracked is so bad. I mean, it's a 64 yard pitch. I hit like 62, but I knew it was into the wind. That's why I flew it all the way there. I was planning to and it wasn't even close. Anyways, what was I saying? Oh yeah, on Friday, I get the brain pills. The new tropics. So, I'm thinking... I'm going to plan my entire trip on Friday when my brain works. If my brain works. Genius, I know. I was also thinking of doing like an actual review, right? Where here is the plan in my head at least. I get up at 7.30 in the morning. I know that's a bit of a stretch. It says recommend dose. You get 45 capsules. So three a day for 15 days, right? I'm going to take two. I'm not going to max it out on the first go, right? And then I can adjust, you know, if I need more juice or less juice if it's too much. I'm going to take two. At 8 a.m., till 11 a.m. I'm going to measure my predict pro productivity. So I'm going to do something like I'm going to have like a task like editing shorts that I've had for like months and shit that I haven't done or something else. I'm going to have a specific task and see in the three hours. Do I just play video games and fucking do nothing like usual or do I do something? And I think it'll be a it'll be a good test. I don't know though. You you can tell I'm not like super on my game right now, so I did make that last putt though on that last hole. And I think that was just like, alright, enough's enough, you know. Let's just put uh, Ruby to bed at 9 a.m. Getting your first nap, Ruby. Definitely getting your first nap of the day. 
So yeah, I just randomly just went off on trip, booster, tacos. We got it all this this video. Alright, I'm just gonna uh, make this one and then probably would have missed if I took the first line and then I seen the dots then and then it's like all right let's finish this uh let's finish this match oh that felt so good it felt like a an absolute legend not bad pretty good though a little more to the right and I would have been happy. That's that's the put you to bed shot of the day. So I'll just run down quickly. Uh, on the 24th at like 4 p.m. I fly to Los Angeles. First I go from Saskatoon, Saskatchewan to Calgary I think. And then Calgary to LA. Get there at like 10 p.m. And then 10 p.m. I spend the night at LAX. And at like 8 a.m. I check in. And then 10 a.m. I fly 11 hour flight to Tokyo. And then I get in at like 2. I clear customs at like 3 or 4 p.m. And then... Um, Hot for the win and then I gotta stay up to like eight or nine and then if I stay in a hostel man it's gonna be a tough sleep but we four and two Ruby new that's just more book the win ramblings but we we didn't play very good but we got the job done hope you enjoyed take care